You probably won't see it clearly, but this is my to-do list for the next three days. Hello girls, it is Monday and it's the end of a very, very, very long two and a half weeks. Um, I didn't get my video up last week, as you know, and it was just because things were really, really crazy with work and me filling in for people's shifts and things and things and things. I think I ended up working, that was my phone, I think I ended up working like 34 hours and three days, so it was just kind of impossible for me to do anything. But anyways, I do uh, want to say hello to Katie, our new Friday, not guest Friday, but our permanent Friday. This has actually been in the works for like two months, two months, two and a half months. Um, we've been doing guest Fridays for over a year and a half, and Katie has been a really good friend of the channel, and I approached Caitlin one day about the idea of bringing Katie on full time, and she kind of laughed at me because she said that she had the same exact idea and was going to approach me about it, so then we talked to the other girls, and then it just ended up flowing really well. So we've known for a while, and it's another reason why Katie was at my wedding, was because we knew that she would be part of the Biggest Beauty Channel, a permanent member, so we wanted to make sure that we were all together for that event, but yes, very excited to be adding Katie, so hello, and I hope everyone makes her feel welcome. She's great. If you are not subscribed to her personal channel, you must. I'm not even a makeup person, and I'm subscribed, so it's that good. Anyways, I will be doing double duty. I want to talk about this week's topic and last week's topic. Last week's topic was Kelly's, and it was, you know, if you could tell a 12-year-old anything regarding body image, what would you tell them? And, uh, you know, if you could turn back time, would you give yourself that advice? Um, well, I think about this a lot because I feel like at 12 years old, it was like a turning point in my life. It was a moment where I wish I knew what I knew now because things would be completely different. I got teased and bullied and picked on from the age of like 9 until 12 and I firmly believe that it was that bullying that made me gain weight. I was told over and over and over again by people at school that I was fat, that I was ugly and I believed them and I gave up and I didn't care anymore and so I just ate whatever I wanted to eat and I didn't work out and I didn't do things and I didn't feel good about myself and it put me on a downward spiral. So if I could go back and tell myself what I know now, I would definitely do it because I think things would be completely different. If I could tell a teenager some bit of advice, I would tell them to not listen to the people around you who are negative. Just don't listen to it. I know that's hard to do because, gosh, you know, if I could have done it, you know, would I have? I don't know. But Listen to the people who truly love you. Listen to your parents, listen to your siblings, listen to your aunts, listen to your uncles, listen to those friends who are really there for you because they see you for who you are and you are beautiful and you are wonderful. You know, I look back on pictures of myself when I was 10, 11, 12 and I was not fat at all. I was very cute and I believed the negative people in my life and therefore I became what I believed and you just need to believe believe in the truth and that is that you are wonderful the way that you are. So we're going into this week's topic which is Caitlin's and it's a very nice topic. It's a little a little love on each other week. I am supposed to say one thing about each one of the girls that I absolutely love and then something about myself that I love. So I'll go in order and I'll start with Amy. Amy, I love your wisdom. I love that you're like 20 years old and you act like a 28 year old. I love that you have your life put together and that you get it and you do it and you succeed because there are not a lot of college students like that. There are a lot of crazy, crazy wild college students who mess up their lives and you are not one of those. You are very wise. I remember the first time I met you on this channel, I could not believe you were 16. I thought you had to have been much older than that. So I love your wisdom. Kelly. Kelly is like the most creative person I have ever met in my entire life. And I know people are going to say, oh, but Samantha, you're just as creative. No. No. Like, Kelly way, way, way goes beyond what I could ever imagine. And I love it. I love seeing what she comes up with because I try to steal those ideas and I try to recreate them myself. But you can never recreate a Kelly work of art. You're just very creative. I love it. 
Caitlin's like Caitlin's like the big sister of the group. I love that she brings everyone together and that she's kind of the ringleader of the madness. She's got a lot of passion. She knows what she wants. She's going to accomplish it. And she's, like I said, the big, like the big sister. I don't know. Like, I feel like if everyone was asked like, to be honest with themselves and who is their favorite on this channel, we'd probably all say Caitlyn <laughs> because we, we, you know, we just all love her. She is, she's like the coolest. She's way cooler than me. And Katie, I don't know Katie as well as all the other girls, so it's probably a little harder for me to come up with it, but I have met Katie before any of the other girls did. I met her like a year and a half ago when I was going through Louisville, and one of the first things that popped out about me, about Katie, was that she was just very, very like easy going. She was a very calm person. She doesn't seem like the type to just spaz out and, and freak out and, and go like haywire when something bad happens. She seems very calm and collective and I like that. I like that about people. People who are stressful stress me out. So I love being around calm and good natured people and that's definitely, it's definitely Katie from my eyes. And finally, I know this is becoming a long video, but what do I love about myself? And I love about myself that I am organized and I can like, you know, execute things if that makes sense not like kill people but like there are people who have creative minds and then there are the people who take the creativity of others and actually make it happen and I think I'm a make it happen type of person um, I like being able to pick people up and just kind of go okay we're gonna do this this is what we gotta do so that's what I love about myself I know they were all kind of inward things and not outward things but that's definitely my love on each other week stuff like I said, I know this is becoming a long video, so I'm not going to talk about my personal life at this moment. We'll save that for some later time. But I love all of you guys. Have a safe and wonderful week. Adios.